Dad, the great tree frog! Oh gray tree God. frogs have sticky feet so they can climb. What's that? The gray tree frogs have sticky feet. Wow. They can climb with the sticky feet. Wow. Like this. Daddy, can Race you is absolutely let's, correct. Let's, let's, let's the gray talk. tree frog is often found clinging to windows in the spring and the summer months here in New England. The toe pads are like Velcro on trees and glass. Scott Tucker here, Expedition New England. Believe it or not, I'm out here in a jungle of sound. As you can hear in my background, we've got Hyla Versicolor, the gray tree frog, screaming and calling all over. The males are calling for females. Take a listen to this. These amphibians are actually arboreal frogs. They're tree frogs. They spend 99% of their time up in trees. The males are calling to the females. They only come down to breed. And that's it. Back up into the trees where they'll use their incredible ability to change color from green to gray and shades in between to stay camouflaged from predators. Beneath the gray tree frog, right behind the upper leg, is this bright orange flash. Scientists believe that this is a warning signal for any creature that tries to reach out and grab it and eat it. It's the last thing that they see just before they bite. And hopefully it scares them away so they can escape. Being raised in New England, every time I would go outside when I was a young child, I would listen up in the trees. I swear to God, I thought these things were raccoons. I had no idea these were great tree frogs. Way back in the 70s, growing up in Guilford, many of these creatures like this great tree frog are nocturnal. And you'll never know what's happening unless you get out here at night with a good flashlight and you listen. 